Welcome back. We're always looking for stories to help you live a healthier life. With more than 90,000 supplements on the market, the vitamin industry is big business. However, what we don't know is how effective all of those supplements are. But there are steps that you can take to make sure you get the best results. 50% of adults take vitamins and supplements, but dietitians say we are not getting the most bang for our buck. There are ways to enhance the uh, absorption, the efficiency of the vitamin and mineral supplement. One way to do that, take fat-soluble vitamins like A, D, E, and K with a high-fat meal. Those fat-soluble vitamins will be better absorbed with a meal that contains at least 10 grams of fat or more. One study shows taking vitamin D with a high-fat meal increases absorption 32% more than with a fat-free meal. Some uh, nutrients will enhance the absorption of others, um, and then some nutrients will inhibit the absorption of others. Vitamin D increases the absorption of calcium, so take those together. Calcium and zinc both inhibit iron absorption, so it's best to take those separately. Caffeine can also uh, inhibit absorption of certain nutrients. People should avoid taking iron with coffee. Most vitamins, with the exception of iron, should be taken with food. When we're consuming them with foods, we also have those like gastric juices and enzymes present that are helping us to digest and absorb those nutrients optimally. Remember that all vitamins are not created equal. To ensure you are getting safe, high-quality vitamins, always look for the United States Pharmacopeia seal. The USP is really the saving grace, I would say, in the, in the world of supplements. With $30 billion spent every year on dietary supplements, a little vitamin savvy can go a long way. It's also important to note that some vitamins and supplements can build up to toxic levels if you take too much. That's especially true for fat-soluble vitamins like A, D, E, and K. Some vitamins can also interfere with your medications, so make sure that you are talking with your doctor about any supplement that you take if you are taking other medications.